Greetings from Foxcroft. We thought it would be a good day to go over some of our new procedures so that you are ready to have a smooth start to the school year. The partnership between school and home has never been more important. Working together, we believe that we can provide the safest environment for your learning in person and online. We want to make sure that you're aware of the commitment to keeping one another safe and healthy. Students will self-quarantine for two weeks before returning for periods of on-campus learning. Face coverings are required in all buildings as they are likely the most effective defense in the containment of infection. To wear a face covering is to show consideration for others, particularly the most vulnerable in our community. Classrooms, dorm rooms, community spaces, the dining hall, and lounges have all been modified for six feet of distancing. Rooms and small porch groups will live as family units. Rooms will be a sanctuary for students, so it's safe to have your masks off in this space. However, movement between floors, other rooms, and other dorms will be limited. You will also notice new signs all around campus. Some will help direct one-way traffic flow in and out of buildings, and some will create one-way stairwells. Oops, this is the exit door only. Remember, read the sign. Thank you for reminding me. You're welcome. Additionally, each room will have signage about the maximum capacity. Well, looks like this room's full. Guess I'll go somewhere else. An online learning option will be available for students who have health concerns or travel restrictions. All classes will go fully online from November 30th to December 18th. And again, for a two week self quarantine period after breaks. Daily cleaning and sanitation protocols have been enhanced across the school. We even have electrostatic sprayers for thorough coverage of disinfectant. Students and employees will continue to be educated on effective hygiene practices, including frequent hand washing and the use of hand sanitizer. Modifications will be made to the size, location, and attendance of community events. Some will be held virtually. Modifications will also be made to food service and dining hall use in cooperation with the State Health Department. We hope you found this information useful. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to me or another member of the staff. Mm -hmm.